Hi, my name is Chris Strand with Liquid Web, and I'm the uh, Director of Infrastructure. I want to take a brief uh, moment to describe our building, uh, our new building, Data Center 3, and describe a little bit about what's going on and some of the challenges we're having with the project and what we kind of see for the project and, and uh, when we expect things to be complete. So, first of all, Data Center 3 uh, is our third building. It'll hold out to be about 90,000 square feet and we expect uh, the building to be ready uh, first quarter of 2009, probably in the February time frame. Basically, uh, we have an existing structure here and uh, the building was purchased uh, earlier this, this year and we're in the process of doing renovations which include uh, new office space, obviously uh, the power systems required, the cooling systems, and uh, actually behind me here, uh, one of our first projects here that is a pretty sizable, uh, noticeable difference um, we're regrading some of the property so that we can get an access drive in for our uh, numerous generators that we'll have on the north side of the building. So in a day or two here, we, they should be done with all the grading and uh, the road. So uh, shortly after that, we'll be starting on uh, generator pads, transformer pads, primary switch gear, uh, trenching for our new power feeds. Uh, so, so that's kind of a big portion of the project that we're happy to have out of the way. So part of our project is also building fiber optic services into the building and uh, those are being extended from an existing uh, fiber ring within the Lansing area but those entrances will come in from both the north and the south of the building on two opposite sides. One of those are along the normal access road but we've just purchased a piece of property to the uh, east of here which will not only um, allow us to bring fiber through but will also allow us to bring dedicated uh, utility feeds from the local uh, electric utility and in addition to that will allow us to build uh, parking because of the fact that this building um, since we're adding a fair amount of office space will need additional parking as well so it kind of serves multiple purposes. Right now we're standing at LiquidWeb's new data center in Lansing, Michigan Data Center 3. It's September 26, 2008 and uh, we're just really getting started on the construction portion of the project. All of our planning and prints has been done and approved, and we hope to uh, open the new data center beginning of 2009, so uh, we're really moving forward pretty quickly. We're standing in what's soon to be LiquidWeb's new data center space, where we'll have about 25,000 servers in here. Behind us, you can see the uh, mezzanine structure, where we'll have about 40,000 square feet of office space. The building is actually going to be in multiple phases, so what we're calling phase one Obviously, it includes bringing in a new utility feed, uh, parallel generator sets, parallel uh, UPS systems, uh, new distribution switch gear, air conditioning, and all the kind of standard renovation you want to do without having to change anything significantly with the building. Phases two, three, and four will be um, later on as we build out the building, which will include additional generation, additional utility feeds, additional cooling systems, and so on. By the time we're done, we expect to probably have um, in the order of 24 to 28 one meg generators as standby power and uh, have a nominal load of somewhere 16 to 19 megawatts of power. So we're standing on the second floor of LiquidWeb's new data center, Data Center 3. This is about 20,000 square feet and it'll all be office space when we're finished. Uh, as you can see we extended the existing mezzanine and all the structural steel is done, all the uh, decking is welded down and next week we'll have all the concrete poured up here and hopefully this will be finished. So on the first floor, which is 20,000 square feet as well, we expect to have about 150 desks down there. And on the second floor, which is also 20,000 square feet, but is lacking in, like we have a quite a sizable training room, conference rooms and so on, there'll be a little less of that up here. So we expect to fit about uh, 220 desks up here.